want to make a video about this. This is the uh, the Oru Beach, and I made a yoke for it. And basically, on your Oru over there, you've got openings on either side, about exactly in the middle of the kayak. So the idea is, I I got a one by four, and made the link just the uh, almost exactly the same size, or actually a little bit more, just a little bit larger, so that you have to push the kayak in on both ends to to, to fit it into place. And this right now will, it's pretty tight in here. It's not going to come out unless I, unless I push on the side of the kayak to loosen it. So then I, uh, I built, these are, these are two by, uh, these are two by fours that I, I connected to it. And on top of that, I put a, uh, some foam to kind of make it a little more comfortable. And then over there, I, uh, I put in an area for my neck to go in the yoke. And my, con my conclusion on this is that this is almost working. I just need to make one modification. This isn't high enough. So what happens when you get when you've got this on top of your head, you're, when you got this up when you're, you're carrying it in normal portage mode, your head is hitting the bottom of the seat right here. It's hitting the seat, and kind of pushing it down a little bit. I guess the floorboard might be better to put it. It's pushing the floorboard. So I need to raise this up a little bit more. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make I'm going to go double foam here. So I because I'm I'm almost there. I think if I raise it another quarter inch, half inch, it probably would be enough. It's just hitting the top of my head a little bit. So if I increase that, and it'll probably give you a little more comfort too, having a little more squishy here. Because I'm carrying it mostly on my shoulders, but a little bit on my head, and I, I need to not carry it on my head. But the boat, also it's very important I discovered, is this boat has to have nothing in it or has to be equally balanced in front and back, or it's really it's really wobbly on your in the yoke. So anyway, just, uh, just want to give you guys an, uh, a video on this. I've been using it. I'm going to modify it. I'm not sure if I really like it that much compared to using my bay and portage. And my, my bay portages really well. My concern about this kayak is if you flipped in it, uh, it, it's not as everything in the bay is going to stay solidly in. I'm not worried about it coming out. This one, I'm a little more concerned about stuff coming out of the kayak if you flipped it. So, but we'll see. Maybe I'll end up using this for different types, maybe for short, smaller lakes and rivers. And the bay will be for medium sized lakes and large lakes. But here's an, just an idea I tried. I wanted to see how it worked on this trip, and it almost successful. Pretty close. All right, see you guys on the water. Bye-bye.